In the TV show Bad Chad Customs, a self-taught mechanic and custom car builder in Nova Scotia, Canada, builds one-of-a-kind cars for his clients out of his workshop. Frequently seen on the program, Jolene collaborates with her fiancé Chad Hilt, Bad Chad, on a variety of customized cars created for the Discovery Channel series. Join us today to know the tragic accident happened to Jolene and truth behind leaving the show. At the end of video, I am going to reveal what Jolene said about her sex life. So, watch this video till the end. Let's begin. Jolene is an important part of the Bad Chad Customs crew, even though she has no prior expertise in the automotive sector. She is in charge of the day-to-day -day management of the garage, as well as the program's business side. Even though Chad does most of the technical work, Jolene isn't performing any less significant job than him. Throughout the performance, Jolene has consistently been really helpful and useful throughout the workplace. Hill Auto would not be the same without Jolene as its CEO. Let's look at what really happened to, to Jolene together. There's more to her than what fans of Bad Chad Customs see. There isn't another showcase of restored cars like Bad Chad Customs. The majority of auto repairs take work that includes learning to appreciate Bad Chad's ingenuity. Come to know Jolene if you're against Bad Chad traditions. Jolene made it clear that she wasn't going to just hang about the business admiring herself. Instead, she was going to make sure that everything got done. Apart from her career naturally changing throughout the years, Jolene hasn't experienced anything unusual. Jolene, a finance student, had no prior experience as a TV personality before meeting Chad. She didn't know anything about car restoration before. She is an expert, however, having worked on Bad Chad Customs for years. Over the years, Jolene has managed Bad Chad Customs in a unique way, using her skills from her financial degree. The program has been salvaged by her economic acumen to such a degree that Chad was forced to concede she is wiser than he ever could be. The lady in Chad's success story is Jolene. 1989 marked the birth of Jolene in Centerville, Nova Scotia. Jolene pursued her financial studies at St. Mary's College in Halifax, Canada after her high school graduation. Jolene had a strong interest in soccer and participated in extracurricular activities while attending college. She played middle linebacker for the SMU Huskies. She is certified in kinesiology and with a degree in finance. She was employed as a supervisor at the Centerville Golf Resort after her graduation. She was a waitress at New Menace and Pool Hall. Jolene met Chad Hill during the annual Rockabilly Weekend Car Event, and the two quickly fell in love. The next thing she joined was his company, Green Goblin. From the minute they met, the two were infatuated with one other. They made the decision to try their spark together. However, they didn't start dating seriously until August 12, 2017, and a few years later, they were engaged. Even though it doesn't seem like they will be married anytime soon, the two are still in a relationship. Jolene has remarked in the past that her job is too demanding and she doesn't have the energy to organize a wedding. Many others do, however, believe that the pair will soon tie the knot. The pair's shared passion for vehicles led them to decide to become professional customizers and restorers. Their final triumph on television was partly due to their love for Bugatti in particular. Despite the fact that Chad was already involved in the company before he met Jolene, their marriage helped it become well-known. When Chad and Jolene initially got together, he needed a manager for his garage, and he knew Jolene could handle the administrative duties of the firm. When Chad made the decision to use a 1934 Chevy chassis to create Jolene, a duplicate of Ralph Lauren's $40 million Bugatti, it marked the beginning of their path into reality TV. Jolene believed Chad's work was so good that she should show it off to the rest of the world. On January 1, 2019, the program debuted on television after Chad's decision to accept an offer from Discover Channel. Jolene and Chad have been aiming to be the most devastated since the premiere of Bad Chad Customs, one of the most watched reality TV shows about car repair. It goes without saying that Jolene and her lover Chad collaborated to give their fans the thrill they had been waiting for. Because of the prolonged break, most fans are starting to think that the program may not return. 
There was a story on the radio a while back about the delectable reality TV show Breaking with Bad Chad Customs. Jolene and the rest of the actors, however, failed to buy into the false story. The couple's relationship is still going strong as well. Dedicated followers could have hoped that the couple, though without a date, would tie the knot soon. Jolene has no intention of quitting the program, just so you know. She's most likely somewhere working with her fiancé to prepare for her incredible comeback to television. Visit the Bad Chad YouTube channel to see all the insane automobiles Jolene and Chad are building off-screen. Over the years, Jolene has been successful in keeping her identity a secret. Theoretically, she avoids opening her personal life to the camera. Jolene, in contrast to other reality TV stars, usually keeps her personal life to herself. The show's main story element is the relationship between Jolene and Chad, which has been going on for more than 10 years. Along with the working together at the business, the two enjoy off-road racing together. They often drive their customized cars on the trails. Jolene has consistently shown her value for the awful Chad Customs. In addition to managing the company's money, Jolene is a filmmaker and sometimes gets her and strong. It was no accident that she was such a skilled manager. As it was, she had to consent to the amount. Since her first appearance on the program, she has managed the garage using her talents. The two informed their supporters that they had joined Houston's Autorama in the last week of January 2024 in a video posted on Chad's official YouTube channel. Jolene is working behind the scenes at Autorama as Chad is showing off some amazing cars with amazing workmanship to the, the audience. The two continue to post videos to the Bad Chad YouTube channel as of February 23, 2024, showcasing their efforts to create valve covers that, for the viewers, closely resembled the Bugatti engine. The stunning blonde is a formidable force in the jewelry industry. She worked as a waiter in the pool area and at a resort to get money. You just need to look at her Instagram profile to see how wealthy she is. She's definitely having her best life with her handsome partner, Chad. When her hectic schedule permits, she often finds time to hang out with her fiancé and go on girls' excursions. Jolene says she doesn't believe anybody cares about couples' personal lives, but she soon finds out that Chad is in a unique circumstance. Jolene claims that they often have more sex at night than in the morning, and that no one has ever offered to them as a threesome, but she isn't interested in that idea. I believe that once you decide to take that action, you can never turn back, she says. I hope you enjoyed the video.